Hey everybody, Tim Norris. And Carmen Norris. And welcome to part three, the final part of our battle against Azatoth and our live play experience of Eldritch Horror. We got two mysteries down and one to go. I will come up here to this location. And Carmen, what are you going to do? Okay, um, what do we need? We need a, a, to close a gate that matches the I, omen trap. Yeah, and the other, the thing that's frightening is, is we have three of these red sun gates out. Okay. I would almost assume that maybe stay there in Sydney and maybe try to close that again. Because if you can close that gate down, it'll also allow you to move wherever you want. Okay. Uh, first I'll do a rest action. Yeah, oh yeah, absolutely. And then I can look at the gates and we can choose which one comes out next. Grand idea. So let's pop those here. We have Arkham, which is another red sun. And Tokyo. Uh, okay. Let's do Tokyo because that would pop right here. If we do move the Omen track, that would allow you, me to be here and you to be here. Possibly between the two of us, we'll close one of them gates. We each have a clue. That would solve the last question. Okay. So let's pop Arkham on the bottom. And we'll put that one on top. Okay. All right. So that was the end of the action phase, 100%. Oh, no. Uh, on my rest action, I'm supposed to roll to try to get rid of these conditions. Okay. So. so do the madness paranoia, or are you do no no, oh. hun, you I, what? are you just roll one die? Yeah. Is that what it's okay? Yes, Good I job. am no longer paranoid. You are no longer crazy. Okay? okay. Now your leg injury. This die did me well. I will roll it again. Hmm. Five or six. Discard the card. No. No. Nope. Okay. I rolled a two. Well, the good thing is you got rid of one. The twos love me. All right. So what I end up doing is I have to fight this ghoul. So let's see what happens here. So I have to do my test of wills. And uh, I get my sword of St. Jerome, which gives me a plus two. My will is four, so that's six dice. Plus it gives me an additional one, so that's seven dice. So if I can get one success, that's seven dice, right? Okay. So I passed that. And it says if you lose health from the strength test, I gain a paranoia condition. Well, let's hope that doesn't happen. So the strength test is normal. My Sword of St. Jerome gives me five, plus I have two, so that is seven dice that I'll be rolling. I need to get at least two successes. Oh boy, here we go again, huh? Yes. Two, there we go, two successes. All so right. the ghoul, finally, the, do you realize that's the first monster we've defeated? <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. They've been beating us up. All right, so okay. I am all done. Now, Carmen is going after the gate. Yes. Ready? Pop, pop. You find others who, like you, have had their consciousness pulled into alien bodies from throughout time. You try to convince them to share their knowledge. It's influence. Well, you can do this. I'm going to roll them really good. Yes! Okay. Oh, look at that! I did roll them really good! <laughs> okay. Their stories are highly illuminating. Gain two clues. Oh, nice! They remind you of a ritual you researched that may provide you with a solution. Okay? Now I do uh, lore minus one. So you roll three dice? Yes! Yes! So we close the gate? If you pass, close the gate. There you go. There we Finally. go. Finally! Yes! <laughs> Man! Oh, I got that. There you go. Great work. Great work. Now, you can go anywhere you want. Am I correct? Yes. Okay. How does that work exactly? When you close a gate during an other world encounter, you may move to any space containing a clue or gate. A clue or a gate. Okay. Yes. Well, I'm thinking possibly move to Shanghai. The next one that's going to go to is this one here, the green comet, okay? There's no green comets on the board, unfortunately. Um, okay. So that, does, that means neither one of us are going to be able to solve this mystery on the next encounter phase, no matter what we try to do. Uh, but it'll be moving to this one here, and we know that that's the next one that's going to flip. It's going to go into Tokyo, because remember, you already saw that. Mm -hmm. So you'll be right here next to this one, maybe close this. Or whatever. Actually, yeah, you would have to move. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You could close this, then we can move over to there, right? Am I getting my actions all correct here? Yeah, you'll close this one on the green comet, move over here on the blue comet, try to close that one down. 
okay if I do that, I can't rest. Well, yeah, you can. There's no monsters here. It's just a gate, huh? I Who's mean, I, I mean, it's going to take me two actions to get there. Honey, you're moving there right now. Oh, duh. You're going okay. where yeah, a yeah, clue yeah. or a gate is. We're trying to decide where we're going to move you. Okay, that's fine. You like that idea? Yeah, that's cool. That'll work. The only other thing is that you meet me here. I don't know how good of an idea that is, though. Well, the only but, other place I wanted... Well, then we could both try to close that one gate. Both of us could try to close it, that's right. Uh, oh, that's no difference. If we're both on a... These are all very easy if monsters. If we're both on a constellation gate... These then, are all pretty simple monsters, though. Uh-huh. That's the thing. Uh, plus, there is a clue. So then I wouldn't be able to rest. No, then you definitely wouldn't be able to rest. So I think we should probably stay separate. The other thing that worries me is that we still do have two of these red ones out. Okay. Possibly getting rid of one wouldn't be a bad idea anyways. If we don't manage to. Possibly. Okay. Yeah. Alright, we'll put you on the shank. Alright, now we're going into the mythos phase. We will advance this. There are no green comets, so the doom doesn't go anywhere. We do the actions. So... This old boy here says, each investigator on this base loses one health. This guy says, discard the nearest clue and move this monster to that space, which would be right here. Wow. Yeah, he's eaten up three clues already. Uh, deep one. Each investigator on this space loses one sanity. Star spawn. Roll one die on a one or two, advance the doom. And, of course. Okay. Nothing, nothing, nothing. The serpent people. Roll one die on a one or a two. The nearest investigator moves one space towards this monster. Oh, oh my god. That's going to be bad. Yeah. Don't roll. Because I do Don't not have a two. boat ticket. Of course. <sighs> Dang. Gone, man. Seriously. All right. Um, I sh I'll go up here next time and then I'll prepare. And make sure you get a boat ticket. And that ticket. way I have a boat ticket right. next time. Okay. okay. Any cards? Yes. You yes. need to roll for your leg injury. Test strength. Whoops. What is it? You with and them dice, <laughs> woman. Oh no. What happened? Stabbing pain. You know the injury is not severe, but w wait, can I? I could try to stop it from happening with a clue. Yeah, yeah, why not? If it's going to be that detrimental, I don't know. And it did. Okay. Yes, okay. So good. you're fine. All right. Uh, we spawn a gate, which we know goes in Tokyo. Now let's put a monster on that space. I just remembered that I had three clues, so. Okay. Now, we're, Riot. we're going to work on the, next, the, the rest of the game to stop throwing dice on the floor. <laughs> <laughs> stop throwing them all over the board. I'm rolling <laughs> my <laughs> dice. <laughs> You know what, Carmen? I wish that I would have tried to have came this direction now. Because, man, both of us meeting here with only just one monster would have been nice, wouldn't it have? Okay, regardless, you can't sleep and you can't stop shaking. Compulsively, you open up your suitcase and count everything, gripping everything you own so tightly your hands bleed. The burden of greed. Event. Each investigator may discard any number of item possessions, then he loses one health for each item possession he has. Well, I only have one, and there is no way in hell I'm getting rid of my sword of St. Jerome. All right. So I guess I get rid health. of my revolver. I never even fight no! monsters anyway. I would not get rid of that. Keep that. But I don't even fight monsters. Carmen, you're going to fight a riot. Don't You don't have no guarantee you're gonna, your spell is going to be successful. Okay, Look, the true. way that you're rolling, do not get rid of that. Just but You're going to get it right health. back. You're going to get it right back. Stop it. Just stop. <laughs> but I'm down to two health. <laughs> now watch, you're gonna die, and you're gonna be like, "It's all your fault." It's all your fault. <sighs> Man, I feel like I am wasting my time over here. I move here, and now I'm gonna prepare to travel because of the stupid serpent people. All right. <laughs> Okie dokie. I'm all set up for the next turn. If it moves here, I can move there, and okay, boom. Well, I'm gonna up. rest. Obviously. I'll just get this. Okay. All right, and now I must. Uh, I can get an incantation. Will you I'm wait sorry. a minute? What? Oh. I only did one action. Oh, well, okay. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm, I'm <laughs> excited. Even, I'm ready. I'm not even done resting. I'm only excited. <laughs> <laughs> of course not. Okay. Now, second action. 
Um, I'm in a city. I could try to get something. Hey, where did... Oh, I don't need a clue. That's right. I can spend my sanity. Yeah. Should I try to get something, or should we look at the gates? Um... Is looking at the gates important at this point? We know our, this is going to increase, but no, I don't think it's all that important personally. Okay, so I'll try to see if I can get something. I'm in a city. Nothing. Good job. Okay. I never get anything. I never get nothing good. Okay, so now I am going to do an Arkham to try to get an incantation spell. The Silver Twilight Lodge members ask you t several riddles to prove your knowledge. I do my lore. Okay. Uh, if you pass, they instruct you in their ways, gain one spell. So okay. it just says I gain one spell, so I'll take the bottom one, which is Feed the Mind, the one I just had. <laughs> there you go. Well, that was supposed to be in the discard pile. No, dear. I put mine on top of the deck. Oh, because I drew okay. from the bottom. Yeah. I drew from the bottom, and it was the exact same spell. That was just kind of ironic. Okay, so Carmen, close it. You can do it. Oh boy, here we go. Influence. At an elaborate masquerade, you talk to a decadent... Oh wait, you talk to decadent party goers who are all maneuvering to be declared as the proper heir to the crown. Okay, here we go. You only need to have one clue to be able to close down the gate up here. It's I should tempting. keep it, though. I should keep it for closing down that gate. Okay, so you failed. What I happens? failed. You suddenly realize you are speaking to the Phantom of Truth. Lose one sanity. I hate that guy. It's weird. Okay. Uh, fear threatens to overwhelm you when you realize he is not wearing a mask. <laughs> oh my god, I thought that was a mask! <laughs> oh, you're so funky looking. <laughs> okay, do a will test. <laughs> Oh and you passed. Okay. It's probably a paranoia condition otherwise. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> All right. All right. So that's the end of that phase. Now we are going into the mythos phase. All right. So we are going to spawn a clue. A clue, a clue. And it goes on number 20. Yeah, right down below you. Okay. Space 2 is going to get this thingy, which is way over there. We will put four mythos tokens. A Our Eldritch coming tokens. for you. Hey, I ain't scared of no what monsters. What monster is it? Uh, no, it's not a monster, is The it? boogeyman. The strange phenomenon of an echo of the catastrophic destruction of Mu. The repercussions of the serpent people's overreaching ambition still takes their toll. It's the serpent people again! They oh. hate you! Fractured reality. Ongoing rumor. As an encounter, an investigator on Space 2 may use an ancient portal created by an old dead wizard of Mu... He resolves an other world encounter. If the effect allows him to close this gate, solve this rumor. When there are no Eldritch tokens on this gate, advance the doom by one for each gate on the game board. Oh, so, you know what? I mean, that we are is scary. We're actually just to the point where we're about to win if we yeah, just well, close one of these gates. <laughs> don't screw up. Okay, so let's see. And now we're in our action phase. So I am going to head here, obviously. What should I do before that? Should I try to improve something? Um, I could possibly improve strength, influence, my will. There's no guarantee I will, but uh, there's a chance that maybe this is a good idea. So I am going to try. I'm going to test my lore, which would be three dice. And let's see if I use my Feed the Mind spell. And I failed. Was it, was it your lore minus one? Uh, yes, which means I roll three dice. Uh, okay. okay, it says, uh, casting the spell, you open yourself to terrible knowledge. Your mind is filled with gibberish, repeating endlessly. Discard this card unless you lose two sanity. Well, I am not doing that, so I'll just discard the card. Okay. All right, so now I will move over here, and I am set up and poised to try to close this gate. Carmen? I'm going to rest. Okay, see if you can get rid of that leg injury then. And then I'll move you over here onto Tokyo. So you just roll one die. 
Yeah, on a five or six, I discard the leg injury. <laughs> okay, so wow. this, this is game right here. I mean, honestly, if if I feel like if we don't succeed Wait. on these, what? We we're not gonna be able. This isn't game. Why? Oh, it didn't advance, did it? It didn't. Advance. Holy moly! I just I just realized that. My goodness. Well, we should still work on it. Worst case scenario, I'll go down here to Rome. I don't know how I'm gonna beat him. I never can beat him. But if I do gain this clue. I could get okay. rid of him. Oh, gosh. Yeah, this is going to be tough. Okay, if I close my gate, I can... You can move over there, too. Okay. And I could use my spell. So this is still a huge deal. Uh, There's a possibility you won't close your gate. You'll just beat the monsters. I didn't even realize it didn't move. I don't know what I was thinking. You might not want to close the gate. Maybe uh, try to dice. just beat <laughs> the monsters. Well, and, I'm going to... Let's know, get started on the Don't try real hard on the gate. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I'll see what I can do. Okay. okay, so let's start on the monsters. We have the cultist. It says, use the cultist information listed on the Ancient One sheet. So if you look on there, it says uh, that they have just one will. And after resolving the will test, lose one health and defeat this monster. So I will roll four dice. Actually, six dice. Okay. And I succeeded, but I do still lose one health. All right, so the cultists are gone. Next, I'm thinking I'll do the ghost. All right, so the ghost is minus one on a will test, so I'll roll five dice against him. If I pass the will test, this monster loses health equal to the will. I need to roll at least two successes here. Oh, yeah, so the ghost is now defeated as well. Okay. So now we're going to move to the maniac, and let's see what happens here. We have a will of seven, and I roll four Five, wait, okay, so he gives me plus one, so four, five, six, seven total dice to see if I can beat the will, or, yeah, the will test, so one success, that's all I needed, so I am fine there, I don't need to worry about the rolling the other three dice. All right, so now we'll do the strength test, which is a strength minus one, so I get two natural strength dice, plus my sword will give me plus five, so that's seven minus one, so I get six total dice. All right, let's see what happens. Oh, oh now it's my turn. <laughs> I did it yeah. All right, so I defeated the maniac. That is three of them in a row now that I have defeated. Uh, I'll get it, honey. Don't worry about it. Okay, she's still... I got it. You got it. Great job. All right, so now <laughs> I will see if... Do I do the clue first, or do I do the uh, gate? Or is it my choice? It's your choice. Sophie's choice. I will do the gate. Well... If you do the clue, the gate will still be open for our next turn. Can you do it? Can you do that? Are you allowed to do that? You choose which encounter you do. You can do a London encounter if you want. Now I can? You can ignore the gate, yeah. So if I do the clue, then that will just leave this gate leave here. The gate. Why don't I do the clue then? Yeah. Okay, we'll see what happens. I don't know why we didn't think of that before. Because okay. we had to have our kids act up and we had to go resolve that. That gave us time oh, to I think. Look. <laughs> oh, are you doing the clue? Yeah. Is that, oh, okay. Yeah, doing the clue. Sorry. Okay. Inside a warehouse, you hear the clanging sound. A clanging sound to discover a creature that resembles a metallic crate walking around on several legs. You try to follow the thing back to the cult's lair. I do a observation minus one. If you pass, gain this clue and one additional clue. All right, well, that's great. I can use my ally, which gives me plus one observation. So I will roll four dice, and I may re-roll one of them as well. So, uh-oh. And I got it! Yes! yes! <laughs> so I get two clues for that. A clue, a clue! And we'll leave that gate there, and hopefully nothing stupid happens when we flip over our other Mythos card. <laughs> <laughs> all right, hun. Okay. It's uh, all you this time. And well, you are on a riot, so you have to see if you can use your spell. How bad is the riot? Do you think I could beat it? I don't know. I don't I don't think I've ever came across the riot. Because I have... Um, you have your 45. But yes. that only gives you plus 2. So I have a 4 for strength. I would just use your spell to try to avoid it. I really Okay, well, the thing is... Oh, you're trying to set your... Well, yeah, you're trying to set yourself up, aren't you? Yeah. The thing is, if I if I use my spell now, I'm going to have to use my spell again next round. I agree. See if you can defeat it. Okay. All right. Ready? The riot. Okay. 
Before oh, resolving the strength God. test, you may attempt to disperse the mob. Okay. So if you roll... Oh, it's influence. your influence. If you succeed here, then they just go away? Yeah. One dice to rule them all. Oh, no. man. Okay. So it is strength minus three. Yeah. So you roll one die. I roll one die. Yep. This is bad. Yeah. Okay. So you take two damage and they do take a hit. So. Yeah, but I take two. Yeah. Which means that not good. Oh boy. Okay. Okay. And that's the end of that, right? Is that the end of that? Yes, I should have done the the encounter where you defeat monsters. That would have been a better idea. Well, you can't. You still have the monster. Oh, you mean like used your... One thing that my character is capable of doing is spinning two clues to remove a monster from any location where there's a gate presence as well. So I could have spent two clues to remove that right from Carmen's location, but at the same time, that is such a hefty penalty this late in the game. What are you talking about? If you defeat the monsters, then you get to do an encounter. Right. This is during the encounter phase. You may... I'm still in the encounter phase, right? No, it's over. Because you lost to the monsters. It's, it's done okay. now. Okay. So now we're in the mythos phase. So this does move. We will now... Oh, great! A monster surge. Perfect! Doesn't matter. You wouldn't have been able to defeat him anyways, so... That means one goes on London, and one will go on Tokyo as well. London, one. Uh, you get a skeleton, and I get the color from outer... Oh, it's got the green squiggly thing. It says, when this monster is spawned, move it to Tungunska. Awesome. That works. All right, plus now we will okay. advance by two, because we do have two gates that match. Now we will spawn a clue. A clue, a clue! And it goes on number 14. Right there. All right, ready? The soldier refuses to explain why you must pass through this checkpoint, and simply asking makes you more suspicious in their eyes. Ongoing. When this card enters play, the lead investigator chooses one investigator to become delayed. Well, that doesn't matter. We're both just sticking where we're at. But you wouldn't be able to try to heal. You can't heal anyways. Mm -hmm. um, if I delay you, what's the repercussion here? What's, what would... What's the, the only action I'd be able to take is to look at the gates. I can heal, which uh -huh. I would like to heal, if I can. It's basically, to be honest with you, this is probably going to be game. Yeah. Maybe, maybe, because the next one will go to here and we can go down to these spaces. Uh -huh. So it's not a guarantee, but it's, yeah, okay. I'm wondering if I should just try to do the London encounter and ignore the gate. <laughs> okay, well, here's we'll the see. thing. I, I, am, I will choose you to become de delayed. Okay. Okay. Or not the London, the water, where I'm at. Yeah, that one. Okay. Mm -hmm. okay. Uh, and now it says, okay, we leave this card out. Mm -hmm. It says for an action, whenever it pops up on the Mythos card, each investigator on a city space tests their observation. If they fail, they become delayed and gain a detained condition. Oh, that's bad. Yeah, okay. So now for my actions here. Um, I am first going to grab... Or rest, I'm sorry. And that will get me one sanity and one health back. Next, I am... I could get rid of this star spawn. Uh, I can spin two clues, and it says, Spin two clues to discard one monster on a space contained in a gate. You don't want to do that yet. Why? Because it says here, once per round, you may spend one sanity in place of spending a clue. So, what if you, I could spend a sanity and a clue. What? What's the matter? What if you end up needing to spend two clues to close this gate? The, our first okay. priority is to close this gate right here in the All right. I agree right? 100%. I agree. Okay. All right. So, I will then just grab... I could grab another boat ticket just in case if I need that. Mm. Trying to think. Or I could roll for one of those. Why don't I try to roll for one of those? Is there anything worth one? I could take out a debt, though. Since the game's almost over. What else way. is there? What's the, Is that Sanctuary? Sanctuary. When you gain this card, you may immediately discard one condition. I don't need that. 
the axe isn't going to do me any good because I'm just going to be trying to close this portal. Is there nothing? What's that Urban box? guide. No, what's the box? Puzzle box. When you perform a rest action, you may attempt uh, to open the puzzle box. Urban guide. What's, well, I can't get the urban guide. It doesn't matter. So none of those are going to help me either. Oh, okay. All right. Well, I agree with you to keep the clues because this could very well be the game here. Yeah. Okay. I'm not going to do anything else. So in the, right. for your action phase, you're standing I back stand up. up. All right. This is it right here. If I succeed on closing this portal, it matches. And then I don't have to worry about what I'm doing. Okay. You find yourself surrounded by ghouls. However, they don't seem to be antagonistic towards you. In fact, you believe you could persuade them to help you. Oh, good. It worked on my weakest skill. Uh -huh. You get to roll influence. one die. Well, the good thing about this is, is I do have the clues. So, all right. Yes! Oh, oh, oh. wow. <laughs> oh, okay. The ghouls direct you to the Tower of Kuth. In the city of the Gugs, as you ascend the tower stairs, an enormous Gug chases you, chases after you. The sound of the monstrosity rattles your nerves. I have to test my will, and I roll four dice on this. If I pass, I close the wow. gate. Uh -oh. oh god! Oh god! It's not gonna pass. Okay. Okay. Yeah, I could spin two. I could spin up to two because I can. My, my passive ability is that once per round. You may spend one sanity in place of spinning a clue, which still fixes this. Okay. Why don't you spend one and one sanity? It doesn't matter either which way, but okay. Yeah. Yes! Did it! Yes! 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 All right. Okay. If you pass, close this gate. You have... N you, if you fail, you hide, blah, blah, blah. Okay. Excellent. The gate is closed. Yeah. I will now spin my clue. And it says here, uh, when an investigator closes a gate that corresponds to the current omen, he may spin one clue to place one Eldritch token on this card. I will spin the clue. The Eldritch token is placed on there. At the end of the Mythos phase, if there are Eldritch tokens on this card equal to half of the investigators solve this mystery. Woo! <laughs> Put your clue in there. No, I didn't. I put it over here. Yeah, earlier. Yeah, the matter. first one. You said. Okay. Okay. Regardless, you still need to perform what else happened in here. So why don't you do your spell and see if you could possibly put a myth. Wouldn't it be awesome if you put an Eldritch token on here too? <laughs> All right. So you got to test your lore. Lore. And you passed. Okay. So you go straight to the gate. I I tip the flip this over. Um, this two. I walk forward boldly, knowing the mist will keep me hidden and no additional effect. Okay. All right. Here is your gate card. And let's see what happens. You find yourself in a familiar city, but there's no electricity. The only light comes from the greenish moon, and the only sound is distant screaming. You can feel your reason being overrun by fear. Come on, Carmen. Will pass. Yes, you passed. Resisting the urge to panic, you find a large metal and glass machine that has electricity sparking across its surface. You try to learn how to operate the device. Lore. You did it! If you pass, you return to your own time and close the gate. <laughs> <laughs> we both did it. We, we both right. closed down the gate, <laughs> spend your clue, and let's put another Eldritch token on here just to add insult to injury. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Okay. okay. Awesome. So now let's go to the. Oh, I, I'll sorry. take care of that, sweetie. Uh, let's go okay. to the mythos phase. Mythos phase. Whoop. All right. So let's see what happens. First, we will advance this. There are one, two that match. Don't don't. Oh boy. So if, close. Yeah. Yeah. We got two left. Let's see what happens. We now spawn. We do a monster. Spawn, so we put another monster here and another monster on Shanghai. So, first one, Rome. Uh, let's go to Shanghai. All right. Uh, the mummy will go to the pyramids. Okay. okay. Now we spawn a clue. Okay. London. All right. In one night, the whole monstr monstrous undertaking has disappeared. Every occult sigil has been... 
sanded from the wall and painted over. Every name on your list has been moved to a new city without notice. You would like to believe that you managed to drive them out, but you fear that it signifies something worse. The dark goal they've been pursuing is now accomplished. That which consumes. Event. Investigators as a group choose one gate on the game board and discard it. If the discarded gate does not correspond to the current omen, advance doom by one. Well, we get rid of one gate. It will correspond. Yeah. Okay. So we so, don't have to advance doom. No. <laughs> so we don't have to advance Woo! doom. So that goes away. All right. We are now at the end of the mythos phase, which means that now the omen of devastation will go away. This clue. We have now solved the third mystery, and according to up here, that is the final mystery, and we win the game. Woohoo! Yes. Okay, so Azatoth has been defeated, and uh, well, you're, you're welcome. welcome. I mean, you know, he just would have consumed the world. Your souls would have been his, but... No know. consuming of souls today, no, Azatoth. No, no, no. Now, uh, we made some mistakes during this video series, and we appreciate all the feedback that we got. Um, I would have to say that as many mistakes as we made that affected us positively, there was probably more that affected us negatively. Yeah, I think it all evened out. For example, uh, I was supposed to be able to roll one die against Mego. You yeah. always roll at least one die, so I wouldn't have gotten damaged quite as bad possibly. And that was twice, too, that you took damage yeah. a couple of times from him when you could have at least tried to negate at least one of those. So, so I'm sure that evens out for the one time that I forgot to flip my spell card and would have gotten damaged. So. Yeah. Um, so overall, this was a lot of fun, guys. Uh, we really appreciate the feedback we received. And our question is, is that would you like to see us try to do another video series with another one of the ancient ones? I mean... Let's face it, we're lining them up and we're just smacking oh, yeah. them around. I mean, We've got yeah. all this experience now, so you know, they don't stand a chance. <laughs> Anyways, um, so leave us some feedback, let us know what you guys think, and uh, we'll just go from there. So until then, thanks for watching. Bye-bye.